Hi, my name is Shruti Vasudev and I'm a bioengineering student at the University of Sheffield, currently doing my placement year in National Instruments. As part of my placement, I was given the opportunity to do a project using National Instruments' latest embedded controller for students, the MyReel. My project is what I call my cube. My cube is an LED cube made up of 64 LEDs in a 4x4 matrix that a user can program by switching on or off any or every LED to create various interesting animations. In this video, I'm going to highlight the major hardware and software aspects of MyCube. Let's use the Rubik's Cube to understand the hardware setup better. The 64 LEDs are stacked together in such a way that every layer of 16 LEDs has a common cathode. Because there are four layers, there are four cathodes. These cathodes are then connected to the MyRio via a Darlington transistor array, which connects them individually to ground. Note that only one cathode can be connected to ground at one time. Therefore, only one layer can be enabled or lit up at one time. Every column or every four LEDs going downwards have a common anode. This gives us a total of 16 anodes. These are then connected to the MyRio via buffers which amplify to give more current than the MyRio can supply. All the programming has been done in LabVIEW. Using the MyRio has allowed this project to benefit from FPGA technology and also run the application in real time. My host communicates with the real time target, which in this case is the MyRio, using USB or Wi-Fi. And the real time target communicates with the FPGA using a FIFO. If I open up my project, you can see that on my host I have an Animation Maker VI. Using this VI, I can create animations by switching on or off any LED in any layer. These get saved as animation files in the animation folder, which can then be dragged on to the MyRio. I then have the real-time main VI, which loads files created from our Animation Maker VI, takes the content and puts it onto the FIFO, which exists on the FPGA. On the FPGA, the FPGA main VI differentiates running, cancel, and waiting states. Running state calls the FPGA FIFO, cancel, empties the FIFO, and idle runs continuously. Note that because of having only one cathode each, only one layer can be lit up all at once, and this creates major restrictions in performing advanced animations. The best solution is to put the theory of persistence of vision in practice. Making use of this theory, I have decided to switch each layer on and off so quickly that the human eye cannot spot it, and it appears as if all layers light up simultaneously, when in reality only one layer is lit up at one instance. Thank you for watching my video. If you want to make your own LED cube using the MyRio, then please click on the links below to get more information. Thank you.